Hello guys, so welcome to another insightful session on my channel. I'm glad you made time to click on this video once again. So um, we are in application season and man, it's been crazy. I mean, I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm chancing on offers upon offers and crazy offers and um, trust me, from now to November, a lot of schools are waiving application fees. Guys, I want to um, encourage you to attend these information sessions, be searching here and there, and also any information I get, I'm here to share with you. So this um, application fees is being waived, okay, by three schools, that is in all totaling 255 US dollars. And you know, the situation back home is so crazy that, that, I mean, I understand. So let me just get into it. So if you're new here, I'll plead that you subscribe, you like, comment and share. How can you get this application fee waived? And also how best you can explore the, hundred, I mean, the scholarship offers available, how to do the application in less than a few minutes. I mean, we should be done. So let's get into it, guys. Ta-da, ta-da, NH, 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 NH. All right, guys, so let's get into action. So the first investor is Investor of Rochester. Um, they are waiving $100 application fee. Let's check their programs that they have available before we even check, um, you know, uh, the, the, how do you call it? The, uh, I mean, the application fee waiver so that you know whether you are in it. So this one is for undergrads. So the grad students, you can reach out to the coordinators and it should be fine. So these are the programs available. They have accounting, they have actuarial science, they have American Sign Language, Arabic, here and Applied Mathematics, nice program. Anthropology is also there, um, astronomy, and through to cell and developmental biology. And then the next one is um, gender, sexuality, and women's studies, geological sciences. So heavy programs, guys. So you should just, um, explore these and you know share with your friends share 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 politics philosophy and economics yeah share with them russian studies russian and the last one is writing studies so once we are done with this we are going straight to the international student the requirement that they will need as an international student i'll share the link in the description how to apply so you can do the common app or the coalition of what coalition for college um application required documents are here you go through them and you will be fine if you have any challenges let me know in the description box and let me go to the application fee waiver how you can get a fee waived so the investor of register is committed to removing barriers for students whose economic circumstances uh prevent them from affording the cost associated with applying so if your family is unable to afford the application fee please complete the application fee waiver request form this form is meant for domestic and international students. That is the key thing. So first year transfer students. So your first year student, that's your fresh freshman. Just for this information, and select one of these. Probably due to the COVID nineteen, you are not able to kind of like you know uh, uh, pay the application fee, which is one of the most um, notable excuses. So that is that. So that is for the Rochester. Your hundred dollars is waived. You can just put in application, get your document, and you are good to go. Now let's go to the another top university, top tier university in New Haven in Connecticut. That is Yale University. This is, a, I mean, an Ivy League. This is a top top tier school. Trust me, there is a there is a top tier school having heavy funding packages. Let's go to the academics. Um, this is basically so. The first one was for um, Rochester is for undergrad. Is for grad students. Yeah, so I'm balancing it for everyone. So with the grad students, they have the um, Graduate School of What um, Arts and Sciences. You can check their website, Architecture, School of Arts, Divinity, um, School of Drama, Engineering, and Applied Sciences, and also Environment and in that order. So let's check the Arts and Sciences. So what do they have? Yeah, so this is what they have there. Um, their programs available. Um, let's check Social Science. Yeah. Uh -huh. So let's check the um, masters, MS probably or MA. Any, any is fine. Let's feel tight. So they have African studies through to um, economics and you know what have you. You can check. I'm sure you get a program political science. Let me know about you with this one. So let's go to the application process. Yeah. So this is how to apply. Um, a master's degree is not required to apply for a PhD program at Yale. Although some programs give preference to you know those with that. So yeah, and. $105 application fee waiver was available. GRE2 requirement waiver is, I mean, available for some programs. Yeah. So that is that. So let's go to the application fee waiver. Yeah. Then engineering too, you can check their programs as well. Graduate study engineering, um, graduate programs where they are, degrees. Yeah. So PhD degree, you can check it out and you will be fine. They have almost um, 40, um, 
stipend of 46,000 for um, student receiving G. That is a full funding. Once you get in, these are these are top schools, and trust me, if you get in, you're fine. So let's take the application fee waiver. So once you create the, if you first create this, I'm an account and you request for the waiver. And you select um, any of these special program. So the special programs probably um, the legibility requirement is there. Let me show you where is it. Yeah. So these are the programs you are talking about. Um, conference. These are the special programs or fellowships. So you can check these. And I'm not sure you'll be able to participate in any of these from where you are watching this video from. So just go to financial hardships. Yeah. Then demonstrate, write, and fill what you have to fill. The first one is does the application fee present a financial hardship? You explain family information, married here and there, annual income. You provide these information. Your current assets. You provide this information. Your current liability. You provide the information. Then you provide um, a loan that you have taken or anything just to support your case and get application fee waived in two or three days, and you are done. Yes, so that is that. If you have any questions, just drop in the comment section. I'll be glad to respond. Then the last one is the Wayne State University. That is in also in Detroit, Michigan. Yeah, so check this one out as well. There's a very good school. They are, uh, the engineering program is already waving. Um, I think um, GRE for almost there are 17 engineering programs. So let me just go to the let me just share that in bit with you. I think I that is a very good one. They are having almost 17 engineering programs and they're waving GRE for all of them. Let me show you that. Yeah, so um, yeah, that is that. So where is it? Um, Detroit, 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 Detroit. Let me go to the admissions. College of Engineering. Yeah. So that is that. Yeah. So the GRE is not needed for any of the seventeen MS programs. No GRE needed. No GRE needed. That is a very good one. Then let's come to the application fee waiver. So this Monday on Monday seventh of November. Please register right now. Register and you'll be fine. Register and you will get your fifty dollar application fee waived and put in the application. So same process. Um, don't struggle with it. Just let me know if you are struggling with the application fee waiver registration or anything. Just let me know. Email me and please. I want to just put this across. You've been able to watch till now. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and also um, ignore any Telegram and um, Telegram and WhatsApp messages in the description. I mean in the comment section. Always ensure that you see my um, verification button or probably uh, I don't send my number in the comment section. Okay, I'll drop I've dropped my email in my community tab and also you can check my description box to reach out to me on LinkedIn and we will connect. Tada energy energy.